Local health officials say more than 100,000 San Diegans have received their shot, but have not gone back for their second. And this news comes as the Delta variant of COVID-19 continues to spread across the country, causing a lot of problems out there. Our Jeff McAdam joins us live from the Embarcadero with the update. Jeff. Hey, Andrew. Hey, Maria. Yeah, in fact, 140,000 people have not gone back for their second shot. That's nearly 7% of people. That's a pretty big number. Doctors tell us today that with this new variant, that's particularly now dangerous, this situation, not having gotten your second. Now, they say just one dose with this second variant isn't nearly as effective. For example, one dose on regular COVID strain has been proven to be upwards of 70 to 80% effective. But on the Delta variant, it may be as little as 30% effective. So you need the second dose. The Delta variant is now the dominant strain of COVID in many parts of the country. And even here within the state, it's projected to be the dominant strain here in San Diego by next month. Doctors today noted that 90 to 95% of people getting it are people who have just not been vaccinated at all, period. And it's hitting younger, uh, younger age groups, hitting people in their teens, all the way up to about 30 years old, the hardest. I had the virus myself, and it is not fun to get. And to be able to speak to patients to say, I know what it feels like. I know what the patients who have called me in extreme distress, and I've had to tell them, hang up the phone, please go to the hospital. Uh, the devastation that this virus causes is preventable. When I had my vaccine, I felt sore in my arm for a couple of days. But in comparison to having COVID, I would much rather have that. Yeah, and despite the raise here or the rise in the Delta variant here in the county, county says at this point we have no uh, thoughts or expectations to go back, uh, back to a mask mandate anytime soon. Uh, you may have seen from a national perspective, the CDC came down with recommendations today that kids K through 12 don't need to wear masks in schools as long as uh, they have been vaccinated. But ultimately, it comes down to what the health department here on the state level has to say. And at this point, they say masks are still what they recommend from the state perspective. From the Embarcadero, Jeff McAdam, Fox 5 News.